Oh, fantastic. Great to be able to eat fried foods without all the guilt. Next, what we have for you is something that's gonna make your kitchen prep much easier. That is the worst job in the kitchen is prepping everything. That's why before the holidays, we do all the prep work ahead of time, and then we do our cooking on Thanksgiving Day. Most of us don't have that kind of time to be able to do all the prepping. That's exactly what the Kitchen Master does for you. It gives you, you're gonna be able to slice, you're gonna be able to dice, you're gonna be able to do so much with it. We're doing it at a holiday price. We have it in your choice of gorgeous colors. We have it in purple, we have it in green, we have it in blue, we have it for you in red black, and we have it in the fun hot orange, $29.95. It's $5 off our regular pricing, and it's on two flex payments at $14.98. This is safer than your knife. <laughs> and Jeff Laurel is going to tell us exactly why that is and how easy this is to it, use. It's too. so simple, and it's all combined into one unit, so it's very easy to use. There's not parts and pieces all over the place. Every professional chef in the world has a mandolin in mm -hmm. their arsenal somewhere. They're usually the $100 or more. Yeah, oh, well, yeah. They, I mean, there's <laughs> some of the mandolins out there are ridiculous in price, and they've got all these parts and pieces that you have to put in drawers all over the kitchen. This is all in one. The knobs on the side adjust everything. So if you want, you've got eight different slicing thicknesses. You can hear, I don't know if you can hear that. You can hear it clicking, mm -hmm. okay? Each click is, one, is a different depth of this platform, which gives you a different thickness of your slice, okay? This blade is razor sharp German stainless steel. And I'll tell you what, just to show you on the, the thick slice for slicing potatoes for pan fries, home fries, raw fries, or cottage fries, whatever you want to call them, they'll fry up evenly because they're all sliced evenly. So, I, But here's the best part about this mandolin. It's called the safety holder. If you've ever had one of these, if you've ever slipped on one of these old four-sided tin the knuckle can grater? knuckle butchers, mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. you lose nails and knuckles on this. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, I'm sure I can find that. a scar for you. This <laughs> is the best invention. It's got five, uh, four stainless steel prongs on the inside. When you push this over your food or fruit or vegetable, the button on top pops up. And now as you're slicing through your vegetable, fruit, meat, or cheese, you can't cut yourself even if you All the way down to the bottom. Slip. It takes it right down to the end, and you get uniform slices. If they're sliced evenly, they'll fry up evenly. And things like bananas, apples, carrots, pears, kiwi fruit. I've got an apple here for apple pies. If you're into dehydrating, again, this is on the wow, thick slice, that. okay? But if you want it thinner, you just move the blade. You know, the thick slice I think is perfect for tomatoes. Nobody ever seems to have a knife sharp enough to slice a red yeah. ripe tomato. Uh -huh. You know, if you ever stabbed one to try and get it started yes. with a knife, you know what I'm talking about. Knives go dull because they hit countertops, cutting boards, plates, and dishes. All this blade ever touches is fruits and vegetables, so they stay razor sharp. And I'll tell you what, look at this. Perfect for backyard barbecued hamburgers, heroes and for sandwiches. It takes it right to the end. And you know, I'll show you some corn off the cob too, but before I show you the corn, watch this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make you a thinner slice because for bread and butter pickles, or for cucumber and onion salad. Mm -hmm. Maybe you'll want to nickel down carrots for canning or slice beets for pickling. Look at this. You can slice one vinegar. cucumber so thin. Look at, oh, look at that. Uh, one cucumber could last you all winter. Look at <laughs> you that. slice them so thin. And when you get close to your fingers, you have that little finger protector so you don't have to worry about your nails, knuckles, and I, I'll tell That's you what. That's also a quick, great, easy little snack, too. For fruits and vegetables, this is the only machine you'll need in the kitchen. It does just about everything. But I'll tell you what you'll love it for. You see, for onions alone, I think it's worth the price of admission. I mean, sliced paper thin onions. Well, you, the reason you won't cry is Why because is the job is done so fast. You don't have time to cry. <laughs> Now, if you like your sli the onion sliced paper thin like this, you're going to love this machine. But I'll tell you, and you can't do that kind of work with no. a knife. But watch this, because by changing the machine... Okay, do you know what my hands would smell like after that for, like, the next week? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Right. This side, yeah. on this knob right here, when you raise these up, they raise up the teeth. You have large teeth for big French fries and large dicing. You've got very small teeth for a really thin julienne or for a fine mince. And then you've got medium-sized teeth. Put it on a medium slice and with those medium teeth. And you can mince an onion in seconds. Okay, I mean, that. Look at this. No lumps, humps, bumps, or chunks. Perfect for tuna look fish, chicken salad. Look how nice and small salad. those are. But you know, here's what made this machine famous and what it was actually designed to do over a hundred years ago in Germany. It was originally designed as a cabbage board for making sauerkraut. You're gonna love it for that long stringy cabbage mm -hmm. coleslaw. Make hot slaw, pepper slaw, mother-in-law, chow chow. I'll did I say mother-in-law? <laughs> look at this. 
All you do is brush it through that blade. Iceberg lettuce on taco night, you'll love it. But if you don't like your coleslaw long and stringy like that, remember, you just turn the knob on the other side, that pops the teeth up, and now you're gonna mince your cabbage deli style. Oh, like they serve different. it in restaurants. Wait, wait, There's you see 12 that? different ways to cut cabbage with this machine. Look at this, perfect for deli style coleslaw. It comes what did you say, 12 different ways? 12 different ways. There's 26 ways to cut celery with the machine. It's that versatile. I mean, okay, if you watch like a celery. fine mince, look watch at this. this. You want to save time with the holidays coming up. You're Look making stuffing, soups, and stews. All right, what if I it want them to more... just be like slices, though? <laughs> if you want to slice, oh, then all you do is you drop the teeth down. Oh, change it up. And now you can slice your keller celery for soups or stews, okay? If you want to do it lengthwise like great? this, you get them long and Look at this, more for a stir-fry cut, okay? If you put the teeth up, now, look at this, if you if you want to make celery spears for your stir fries, or maybe you're wow. making a vegetable tray, everything you see on this tray up front here was all done with this one machine. It took I about 20 small. minutes to make with this machine. You can see all the different types of vegetables. You've got thick slicing, you've got thin slicing. Look at the oranges you get, too. <laughs> yeah, it does fruits and vegetables. All of your dicing for taco night, you do your tomatoes for homemade salsa. In fact, Watch this, because for tomatoes, here's a little tip. All right, by the way, this entire setup and display was done in less than 10 minutes. Yeah, if you, if what you see out here, <laughs> that's done in less than 10 minutes. Took more time probably to figure out yeah. the design you wanted to do I'll with tell that. You, if, Look at how fast this if is. If you were to buy that tray in the supermarket made up for oh. you, it would cost more than the machine. I mean, you make one relish tray like this with the machine, it's already paid for itself. Look how quick yeah. we diced a tomato. On taco night, you're gonna love diced oh, tomato yeah. for salsa, soups, or stews. And you know what? The kids love yeah, the kids love the French fries. And I'll tell you why. Look well, at the colors too. I mean, <laughs> beautiful blue. We have it in purple. Purple's a color that we don't see all the time. So we have. Thank you very much. That's probably a better way to do it. As I'm pulling these out. So purple, green, blue. Red, always one of our hottest colors and hottest accessories that we have. The classic black is great for yep. a lot of the guys. Halloween's coming up right around the corner. Kind of fun to have that in the orange. Yeah, I thought that was appropriate. You know, I like the tangerine myself. Yeah. And I'll tell you, look at this. French fries by the mounds. You'll make French fries by the pounds. In fact, with that air fryer that we just That's had on, it. you drop these French fries in there. Now, if you like a shoestring style cut, then you bring this back up to you use the smaller teeth, and now you can do your shoestring French fries. You know, you, you go to the fast food restaurants, you know the ones I'm talking yes. about. It's 95 cents for a four ounce package of French fries. All right, that's four dollars a pound for potatoes. You can make them yourself for, for that same amount for fifty cents. I mean, look at that. Say that again. Uh, Ninety-five cents for a four-ounce package of French fries in the fast food restaurant. Okay. That's four dollars a pound for potatoes. Go to the supermarket, buy them whole like this. Now, hey, fresh is better than frozen oh, any day of the week. Okay? And you can have them and, any thickness you and, like. And so if you, you like more of a steak all fry, the, all the different vegetables. If you, you want to do, do all gratins, an afternoon snack for the kids. Look how good these are. Healthy, do this and make matchstick apples like Isn't that this. Isn't cool? A little bowl of melted caramel in the microwave and the kids Peanut go butter, crazy. Peanut butter, Carameled apples this time apple of year. Apple fries. Oh yeah, that's ah, delicious. Yum. And for dehydrating like that, make apple chips the same way. I promised you corn off the cob and then I'm gonna clean off my tray here okay. and show you a couple We've more cuts. We've been describing but... and everything, look at everything that John has done <laughs> out here and that's in seven minutes worth of time. You know, if you've ever tried to take corn off the cob with a knife, it, it flies all over the kitchen. You get corn Good in luck. your eyebrows, in your hair, Expert. up on the ceiling. Uh -huh. Watch this. The, use the thick slice, lay the ear of corn down. Now, at home, uh, you can't use the safety holder for taking corn off the cob, okay? okay. So put an oven mitt on your hand if, okay. if you're worried about it. Or lay it off to the side of the machine like this. Besides, oh, if you blanch your corn first anyway, it's gonna be hot. You'll wanna wear an oven mitt anyway. Oh. But all you do is brush it through. And each time you brush it through here, it takes four or five rows of sweet corn off the cob. You get Look full kernels of that corn. Takes it off. But you don't get any cob in the corn. <laughs> you get and the, there's a ridge along the side here. You can milk your cob for your cream style corn for your uh, succotash. Look at Soups, you. stews, chowders. Yeah, that way you don't waste anything. You get well, look at that. You get the worms and all. Look at that. <laughs> if you're vegetarian, you can pick out the worms. <laughs> <laughs> I can't pick the produce. Okay, I just buy it and bring You know it. you've eaten so, them before. <laughs> Whether anyway, you thought you did or not. I'll tell you, it does more work than any electric expensive machine. Take a couple of wax off a carrot like the or a, a carrot, a, a bell pepper, pull the heart and seeds out like this, and look at this for pepper rings, perfect for salads or for stir fries. If you like them thinner, watch what I'm gonna do. 
I'm going to just turn the knob on the side. You can adjust the thickness to whatever de 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 depth that you mm -hmm. desire. And now with that safety holder so you don't cut yourself, you can make those, look at those thin, thin look at peppers. Look at, this, look at that. Perfect and uniform. There's no way that you can do that with a knife. I mean, I mean you'd need a $1,000 knife in a hand like a brain surgeon to cut a pepper that perfect and paper thin into rings. That's incredible. That's why every but professional look at the chef minting, in the world the dicing, has a mandolin. The julienne. Yes, it does it all. It well, and normally with the mandolin, because I, I have one that was over $100, oh, sure. I have to change out the pieces. <laughs> I have to change out the blades when I want to do that. I can do them thicker or thin, but if right. I want to do the dicing and the other stuff and the chopping, just, it's a separate blade. I always say, so it stays just in the box, the in the cabinet. Of, yeah, Seriously, yeah. other than like yeah. once a year, I pull it off. Yeah. This one you keep right in your kitchen drawer. In fact, I want you to see this. This is all the room it takes up in your knife drawer, okay? Keep it in your knife drawer. That way when you see it every day, you'll use it every day. Look at this. I mean, just for slicing onions, paper thin for salads or sandwiches, for sauteed peppers and onions, that for steak and onion, liver and onion. But the, well, the job's done so fast, you don't have time to cut. But here's the other thing. No, <laughs> when, when, look, when you're when doing sliced, that, you, with when you're cutting into the onion, you know, the onion kind of oh, does yeah. that. That, that little is bit is enough. Sharp. Look at that. That's such a now, nice sharp blade. If you have, if you happen to have a red dead beat, a red beet laying around the house, <laughs> put a red beet on the safety holder and on the thin slice. I want you to see this. Look at this. Wow. Now you can do your own. Th now, these are red beets, perfect for boiling, perfect what? for salads. If you want to change it up, you want to uh, give your There's company your something end. to talk Look about. How thin that is. Over the holidays. Try this on a salad. If you don't, it, listen, I love fresh beets, wow. okay? But do this julienne like this Color. over a salad. Watch what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put the, the, the uh, beet in here and we're gonna, we're gonna uh, julienne this beet perfectly for over the top of the salad. The whole beet, no fingers, no blood. I want you to see this, look at this. Oh, look Perfect at julienne over a salad. Red beets, oh my turnips gosh. the same way. Rutabagas, turnips, I mean, look at this. So you do it kind of on the end and then <laughs> you can start with your hand if you like, uh -huh. okay? When you get close to your fingers, use that safety holder. Believe me, using this machine without using the safety holder is kind of like driving a car without brakes. <laughs> you always want to use it with that safety holder. That way, if you slip, your fingers are protected. Wow. But, I mean, how many people have slipped on one of these things? <laughs> no. <laughs> Just, I mean, try and... <laughs> I'm going to give you the best ridiculous. advice I think I can give you this entire holiday season. <laughs> I spend almost three weeks preparing just for Thanksgiving right? dinner. Buy this today, it will save you so much time, but what you'll find is it's not gonna be that once a year when you just pull something out. You're gonna use this all the time. You're gonna use it for everything, but you'll also put things into, you know, maybe you just bought the Nutribullet RX that we've had over right. the past couple of days, or maybe you already have a Nutribullet. You're trying to get more of the vegetables in there. You'll also find that your vegetables don't go bad quickly, because it's always the, oh gosh, I gotta cut them up, and do right. I wanna chop them, do I wanna julienne them, what do I wanna do, do I wanna put them in soup? You're gonna put them in, you're gonna put them into your soups, you're gonna put them into your salads. You're gonna have the most wonderful addition into your home. And, and then a, choose the color that you want. Tool. Great gift. And yeah, too. with the, I'll tell you, hey, for what, what does it work oh out gosh. to? Like three bucks a finger, okay? <laughs> it's worth it just for the safety holder alone. If you've got those tools, not, if you've got nothing but a drawer full of dull knives or know that person who loves to cook and you can't think of anything to get them for for the holidays, I'll tell you what. It, this one, and it's a juicer. It's the, by the perfect way. gift for anybody that does any amount of cooking. By the way, it does way more work than any electric mm -hmm. expensive machine. We already talked about that for French fries alone. But I want to show you this too: cucumber icicles. The kids love these things uh, as a quick afternoon snack. I'm going to put it on the thick uh -huh. slice, and I'm using the large teeth, and I'm going to brush this cucumber through lengthwise like this. You put these in a bowl of ice water in the fridge for when the kids come home from school. I'll tell Yum. you what, look at that. Oh, for look long, at that. Look, for long cucumber icicles, the, I mean, the kids Yum. love these things. They eat them like candy. This also doubles as a juicer up at the top, so yes. you can take and you can yes. use that for your That's lemons, right. for your oranges, everything else, and it's got like a little bowl up in the top. That's your handy holder. It has all the color choices available for you. In the purple, in the red, in the black, the orange, the most popular right now is the red, I believe. So the red and the blue are currently the fastest selling. You want to get yours, but all the other color choices. I think purple's kind of fun just because you yeah. don't normally see it. <laughs> right. And these are nice and small and compact, and you're not going to cut your hands every single time That's you put right. it into the drawer. So. Hey. If you use it just for corn off the cob. Yeah. I mean, think about it. Corn it's actually off the cob. Yeah. <laughs> and the cream corn, all the different things that you can do, but chopping, dicing, slicing. It does you know, everything. You're going to do it all.
This is the hour of must-have products. There's no doubt about it. So it's a great opportunity to buy more and save. You pay the highest standard shipping and handling on any individual item that you buy in our kitchen and home. And then 50% off on your shipping and handling on all the rest of those items. $29.95 on that. It's on two flex payments, $14.98. Wildly popular. We have hundreds of you in the ordering process. That is a great gift. If you're going to somebody's house for Thanksgiving, take this instead of a bottle of wine.